This is the sleeve joint installation procedure for butt welded vacuum lines, written and spoken by Daniel Bourne of Cryocrop Australia. As you can see, pipes have been tacked together. Spools in alignment for sleeve connection process ensure that the sleeve jacket slash tube is already slided onto one of the spools. This will be slided back once the inner join is complete. This is a close up of the tack join. Welders then butt weld the ends together. Note how the sleeve has already been slided on. This is particularly important with elbow spools. Once the vacuum line has been welded together, the joint is cleaned with soapy water and acetone. Wait for the joint to dry, then begin wrapping with tissue paper. The tissue paper prevents the conduction heat transfer between stainless steel pipe to the aluminium foil. After the join has been covered with paper, the multi-layer insulation is wrapped around the paper. Multi-layer has a minimum of 16 layers, paper and foil each. Make sure there is an even coverage. Also note that we use cotton gloves during the insulation to prevent moisture and oils getting into the otherwise perfectly clean vacuum area. It will be necessary to use foil tape to secure the multi-layer in place but try to keep the usage of the tape to a minimum. Again, ensure a minimum of 16 layers covers each section. There must be no gaps at all, no exposed pipework inside the vacuum space. Covering all sections prevents the transfer of radiant heat. Also keep the annular space as small as possible by filling it with multi-layer. This reduces the time in pulling the vacuum down by several hours. In summary, two layers of paper, 32 layers of multi-layer, the wrapping stage is complete. Now we slide the sleeve over without damaging any of the wrapping or pipe work. Make sure the vacuum port is at the top of the tube work. While not vital, it is handy to use a level to ensure the vacuum port is on top and in line with the other vacuum ports on other spools. For safety, we purge through the inlet valve prior and during the welding. The outer sleeve has now been completely welded. Thank you for watching. For details on the vacuuming process, please refer to the vacuum process instructional video.